Great men are not always wise. What a pleasant surprise, Mr. Marston. An informer just told us some interesting news. Our mutual friend, Mr. Vanderlyn, is about to pay call on his bank manager. Hmm. What do you say to have a little financial discussion with the fellow? <laughs> this way. Sounds good. Let's talk about them stocks and bonds and the market conditions that have been fluctuating. Let's get up on the roof. We'll have a clear shot at them from there. Come on, you old fuck. Hurry up. Taking forever. Is this a new kind of sniper rifle? That door is the only way in and out of the building. So cover it tight. Do you see those horses to the left by the building across the street? Dutch's boys hitched them there. They'll have to go <laughs> that way. See how that wall just popped into fucking load? Don't start load. shooting until they're out in the open. If we spook them, they might retreat back and hole up inside. Don't shoot till I give you the signal. Keep your sights trained on that bank door. You do realize I'm Guy Crossfield, right? Don't shoot till I give you the signal. Someone's coming out. He's unarmed. Hold your fire. The bastard's still Hold your fire! I can't fucking hit him, dude. Thank you. Where are they? You're not making a break for it. There's nobody there. What are they shooting at? Shoot, Marston, the door to escape! What are you shooting at? There's nobody there. Dude, they're shooting at nothing. There's nothing fucking there. Why are you shooting? You can't let them get away! Dude, the game is bugged. They're not coming out. They must be stuck inside that building. I'm gonna have to go after them myself. I can't even climb down from here. Are you serious? I'm fucked. I can't do this mission, dude. I couldn't do it. It's not my fault. The game's fucking all buggy now. There's all kinds of problems with these missions now. The fucking two dudes never came out. They were stuck inside. Nobody shoots until I say. Don't shoot. That man is a hostage. <laughs> Let's kill Save the hostage this time. Huh? Oh. oh. See, they never opened that door last time. There was a game bug last time. I want to take the Got 
Which is last one to shoot at? Aha. Uh -huh. Got him. Did it. Cool. Didn't bug out this time. With Hopkins and Manny. Get Dutch. Be careful. There may be some the innocent people there. They're still shooting? What the hell? <laughs> Kill these assholes. We can take them. Yes, we can. I'm going shotgun. They'll come to the windows from up top. Let's get at these cocksuckers. Got another fucking posse, this baby. Marston, shoot the door. Open sesame. Get us through that door. Let's go. Come on, bro. Fuck! Oh my god, dude, as soon as I walked up, I got killed. That's fucking bullshit. <laughs> that is fucking bullshit. Immediately, I get gunned down. I can't see jack shit. Come on, let's, let's get in there! Shoot the lock off that door! Again, I'm like, about to die again. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> Shotgun blast and this guy's fine. Four shotgun blasts and he's fine. What the? Into the town hall. Cocksucker. <laughs> Good work. Dutch ain't down here. He's got to be hiding upstairs somewhere. Such is here, I'm gonna blow his fucking brains out. You what the hell just happened? Oh shit. Oh, it's nice to see you, John. Hello, Dutch. How's Abigail? Well, I hope. I ain't seen her for a while. Because you've been chasing me? Let the woman go, Dutch. Of course. Of course. How's your little boy? Just dead eye this asshole You're right so now. little now. Oh, he must be what? 15? 16? Doesn't time fly? Don't adjust. It's over, man. <laughs> of course. Of course. I surrender, John. You're the master, man. I've been my master since you left me to die. We all make mistakes, John. I never claimed to be a saint, but equally, I never took you for an errand boy. Just trying to help my family, Dutch. By making compromises, we all have to. Now let her go. Shoot this motherfucker. So, Come on. You want the girl, John? You always were the romantic sort. You know, gentlemen, this man here, oh, he married a whore. <laughs> Used to ride with us. We all had her. <laughs> oh, my God. And you know that what a prick. A better man than us. He's a better man. Have the girl. Yeah. Easy, Dad. Would you just fucking rain bullets into these assholes? <laughs> I told you. You should have just fucking did it, dude. Now go catch him. I don't see him. What the hell happened in there? This is your fault, Marston. Of course. You got a gun too, Sheriff. 
You waited too long! Get on your horses! I just saw a Dutch make a run for him! Let's get this asshole. Come on, come on. I knew he was gonna do that the whole fucking time. Just fucking, I would have shot her in the leg so she would drop, and then I would have fucking blew his brains out. Cause he would have been so surprised that I fired, he wouldn't have known what to do. Hey, what happened in there? We saw the angel and escaped me from some man. He's gone. The bank manager in an automobile. Let's just say, Dutch ain't gone and got himself safe. Killed some poor woman. There's an old logging camp further down this road. It's been abandoned for years. My guess is that's where they're headed. Come on, follow me. Huh? Logging camp, huh? What the fuck happened here? I didn't. What the hell? I, I, whatever. I don't know what just happened there. So that's the great Dutch. What a role model. The man who made you who you are. What a role model. So, has he changed? No, still the same crazy bastard he turned into. How was it seeing him after all this time? Well done, your heart strength. <laughs> reminds me of you. Yes, he warmed the cockles of my heart. He confused himself with God. Isn't that sweet of you? And now you must kill him. Your side is chosen. My side ain't chosen. My side was given. I kill you a hundred times before I kill Dutch. It's <laughs> an option. Hallelujah! I think we're finally reaching an understanding, Mr. Marston. That's why they still have his friendly kidnapped, because they know that if they let him go, that he's gonna fucking kill people and probably kill them for uh revenge. Alright, good. He must have fucking uh must have crashed, wrecked, and uh, had to come to the forest. Native Americans we have to fucking kill. It really is. What? They expected they were gonna be fucking upstanding citizens after you stole all their goddamn land. <laughs> no, I don't want a fucking throwing knife, goddammit. Ah, I knocked our own dudes on his ass. Trying to take cover. Woo! Oh, you motherfucker, you're so lucky. One left. Ay, 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 ay. Your fucking mouth. You must have a real bad death wish. <laughs> Where's Dutch, Marston? He got away. Damn it. Scared to shoot him? Too much to handle? When the opportunity presents itself, I'll put a bullet in him. Don't you worry. Won't like myself for doing it, but I'll do it. Hmm. Ah, good man, good man. You know, at the end of this, you'll probably get a medal. I know I <laughs> Damn. That was fucked up. We had to kill all these poor natives who teamed up with Dutch. 
Fame up, but no honor. I'm not getting any honor for any missions anymore. You probably only get honor for uh, for this, like the, the the side missions of saving people and stuff. Now that'd be my guess. Don't think you'll be needing this. Look at this fucked up cabin. <laughs> Nothing in here. Just a chair that falls apart. Excellent. Here either. Hummingbird Sage. Hell's going on over here? Somebody's getting attacked? are attacking him. I'm stuck. I'm fucking stuck again. <laughs> Ran out of bullets. My fucking horse bucked. Why didn't you shoot him? Shoot the fucking wolf, you asshole. Thank you. Wow, you guys are scary. <laughs> wild, wild west, motherfucker. Wild, wild west. Well, I guess it's back to town, right? Alright, so what uh, missions do we have left? Let's see here. Well, no more FBI missions for now. Looks like we gotta do another McDougal mission. All right. McDougal! I don't know why, I just keep hearing McDougal in my head being played to the tune of McGruber. McDougal! Makes all kinds of explosives out of household materials. McDougal! What? 7 a.m. and 10 p.m.? Fucking cock. Fuck you. Fuck out, fuck out. I'm going to go back to sleep. Just fucking bullshit. You know that picture? I go back to fucking sleep because no one's awake. I said suck my balls and lick my cock. Yes. Okay. Here we go. What time is it now? It is 7 a.m. No, it's not. It's... Almost 7 a.m. By the time I get to McDougal's, it should be 7 a.m. And the same dudes are here still playing cards. No, they're not. They actually all left. <laughs> Boosh. Oh, I want to knock her over. McDougal! What the fuck, man? It's almost time. Let me run over here for a second. Check out the square. Into the birdies. Listen to the birdies. No optional missions around, huh? Can I go into City Hall here? Is that what this is? Nope. I will not let you. The town of Blackwater. Why is the water black? Two cops. Marston, always the players, but I don't deny it. What's the rush there? Huh. They're talking about me, probably because I'm famous. So over here in the water. Look at how beautiful look the water, man. It's amazing the detail. Look at this shit. Now I step one foot in there, I die instantly, too. That's the bonus. Alright, now it has to be seven. What the fuck? Is this guy floating? His foot is floating. It's not really... Look, look at that. It's off the ground. <laughs> you fucking floater. How dare you? You're not allowed to float. 
Watch this. You're looking very pretty, man. <laughs> hey, come here. Oh! Oh, I missed. Didn't you kick this guy in the face? Oh! Oh, I missed. What the fuck? <laughs> why, did it, didn't you, why did it miss? That's bullshit. So I nearly kicked him in the face. How about this dog? Oh, walk right into it. All right. For purely scientific purposes. Looks like we're going to be killing more Native Americans. Great. Something else to make me feel miserable on my conscience. <laughs> Darth Marston, sir. What the fuck? Good to see you, Olby. Good to see you. And you too, Professor. It's all fucking wa- Shh, you stay high again. Agitation, partly due to standard narcotic impulses, but also due to the fact that I have finally solved the riddle that has tormented my mind these past eight years. Okay. What's that? The nature of the savage soul. Ah! What makes some societies <laughs> great, like ours, and others, uh, again, not worse. I would never use a bunch of words such as worse, but, 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 but lesser. Meaning me. Well, look at these beings less human than us. Closer to beast on the continuum between animal and god. You know, I argued with Fortescue at Yale about this. It caused a minor scandal. But I shall be proven right, sir. I shall. All my right. My words. I shall show Give this guy another fucking hit. It is all about hit the, the bomb. skins and the knobs at Yale. Come, sir. I have a way to see both our desires. I will bring you, Vanderlid, and me the evidence of savages reverting to type. Come, sir. Holy crap. Now, this guy definitely isn't smoking weed because he is not mellow at all. He is fucking wired and crazy. Where the devil is Nastas? He should be here with the horses. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, great. You just run off by yourself. My heart's beating like a drum. Try to calm down, Professor. Calm down? I've never been so excited in all my life. He's insane. Hello, Professor. Mr. Marston. Come on. Good to see you. Come on. What the hell? Why is the horse humping the sign? Come on, man. This is it. Years of research. What were you talking about back there? Where are we going? Nastas has set up a meeting. A powwow, I think they call it. A meeting of minds, huh. of souls, Indians and whites, academics and criminals. Coming really? To find a common understanding. Nastas, this fool's making no sense. It sounds like a Some setup. Vanderlyn's men have agreed to meet with Professor McDougal up at Bearclaw Cabin. Why the hell would they want to do that? I think they are interested to find out what conclusions a white man has reached on hundreds <laughs> of years of culture and society from the comfort of his hotel room. <laughs> from the comfort of his hotel room. I could ask for a skin sample from the soles of their feet. I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> They're gonna kill him. They're gonna fucking yeah. cut his fucking scalp off. Watch. And he deserves it. He's a crazy motherfucker. Yeah, we definitely don't side with the best of types every time uh, in this game, do we? I'm a little nervous, I have to say. A <laughs> bunch of the old jitters. No kid. That's no small relief to have the two of you all. Easy. Oh, oh, God, kill it. You asshole. Now we have no choice. <laughs> That was fucked up. If he didn't shoot it, we would have been fine. We would have went right by it. But he fucking shot it like an asshole. I should shoot this motherfucker. He's an asshole, man. That fucking dumbass McDougal piece of shit. Throw him off the fucking cliff. Cocksucker. Here, I'm gonna fart in your face. Horse turds in your fucking face. Suck my dingleberries. Oh shit. I hope I don't have to smoke a pipe. Oh, here they are. How? This is definitely a setup. They're gonna try to kill us. Hello, gentlemen. We come in peace. Those words mean nothing coming from people like you. <laughs> Look at what you've done to us. Look at us! We live like animals, scrabbling in the dirt. But I... But, but I... But silence isn't the answer! Maybe you live in a different America than we. 
men like Vanderlint will lead you to disaster. I think we've already experienced disaster. Uh, he's got a point. Like, which you can only imagine. Put your hands up! We come in peace! Do we see Sebastian? To call this a meeting? Give me your damn weapon. Yeah, right. This is not what we agreed to. You shut your mouth, you treacherous snake! Oh, he killed him! Touch. Fuck this! Kill these motherfuckers! Get down, get down. You fucking cocksucker piece of shit! You wanna fuck with me, huh? Fuck with me? You no know, good for nothing, sons of bitches! Fucking goddamn ankle biting piece of. Oh, fuck you! Oh, fuck you! Oh, not done yet! Oh, one more! Oh! I've had about enough of field working today! Time to return home, sir! Right, let's go now while we got the chance! You don't get to tell me twice! Let's get back to black! Holy shit, you saw how far he jumped? <laughs> Can't believe they killed Nastas, man. An honorable fucking Native American. Come on! Gets killed for no fucking reason by his own people. That's fucked up. I mean, I understand they're upset. They lost their land. Their lives are ruined. But you'll kill one of your own, man. This can't be happening! Got fucked up. I wasn't even watching where I was going. I just fucking was shooting from the hip and I killed them all. Let me do go. Oh fuck, here come more. Here come more. Fuck. Dude, this asshole behind me, look at this. Look at this bullshit. The game's supposed to auto-aim when you press left trigger, yet he refused to auto-aim. Whatever. Love it. I love dying for no reason because the game doesn't fucking decide to work with its own game mechanics. I think that's all of them! Let's go! The game has a fucking left trigger auto-aim for a reason, and then it doesn't work. Yeah, how am I supposed to ride and kill enemies at the same time? You can't. That's why you have an auto aim. If I go to do it, it didn't work. Hey, I did something. Come on. Happy now? I don't see any more of them. <laughs> Come on, Professor. Let's get you back to Blackwater. I'd appreciate it if you would, Mr. Marston. I'm a shadow of my former self. Yeah, that's fucked up that they killed Nastas, man. I'm pissed. He was a tough, a tough ass, too. He got shot right in the stomach, and he was fine. I can safely say that that was the worst experience of my life. I wish I could say the same. Blackwater. Uh, I would never talk ill of you again. Civilization in all its glory, Mr. McDougal. And am I glad to be back? I'm in dire need of a syringe. So <laughs> we can clear the mind and restore the spirit. So you ain't planning on sleeping then? Sleep? My dear boy, I'll probably never sleep again. Huh. She get all drugged up. No! Why is everything empty? What is going on? Easy! Safe and sound! Thank the Lord! Huh. So much for a meeting of minds. Thank you, Mr. Marston. I could be boiling in a pot right now if it wasn't for you. Huh. Get some rest, Professor. Wow, that was a shitty ass mission. Fucking we lost Nastas, man. We got no fame and we got no honor. We got nothing. All I gotta do another McDougal mission. There's nothing left to do. What? Now I have to come out back between 6 p.m. and 5 a.m.? Are you fucking for real, dude? What time is it? 9 a.m., so I can sleep again. I just sleep twice. What's the popcorn? The fuck? Don't you move a muscle now. Sorry. 
Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Go again.